Okay, how a clutch works. The purpose of a clutch is to transmit your crankshaft rotation to your transmission to ultimately your wheels. This transmission of power uses some devices and these devices are as shown. You have a flywheel which is bolted and connected to your engine. You have a clutch disc which is sandwiched in between the flywheel and the pressure plate. And you have a release bearing which when you press on when you press in on the clutch, you press down on the clutch, it pushes inward lifting the pressure plate which allows it lifts the it lifts the pressure plate which allows the clutch to spin freely this is called disengaging the clutch so what you have is your engine your crankshaft in here your flywheel is connected to it and then you have a clutch disc which is splined the spline is then, well, before I get to that, your pressure plate, this goes on the flywheel, pressure plate goes on there, and that spline is the, the bearing, the release bearing. It connects all the way through. Now, in this silly drawing, here's your clutch, and these little, oh, mechani this little mechanism right here barely separates your pressure plate from your clutch it gives it a slipping effect here's your pressure plate <laughs> it's drawn kind of funny but the point here is these fingers there's little manger little manger little metal f fingers right here that when the bearing your uh, your throw out bearing whenever you push whenever the bearing when you push down the pedal your clutch the bearing pushes in on these metal fingers which they they bend a little bit they bend in which disengages your clutch so in a very crude crude drawing here's the your back to your engine your crankshaft right here and then here is your flywheel here's your clutch which is sandwiched in between the back of the engine and your pressure plate this is all squished together and this spline shaft is connected from the transmission to the engine. This is all in a bell a bell housing. And whenever you the bearing is pushed, whenever the bearing is pushed down, it pushes this way, which makes this come out that way. And that way your engine is spinning, your engine crankshaft is spinning, and it's not connected. The transmission is spinning from here but it's not together so when you release when you put it in gear this all sandwiches together it engages the clutch it engages all together and the engine spin is synchronized with your transmission and your transmission is a whole other story there's all kind of gear ratios and all kind of fun stuff within the transmission and I'll go over that later thank you and I hope this explain at least a little bit of how a clutch works on your car. Uh, clutches are also in electric power drills. It can separate the um, the chuck and the actual um, motor inside the electric drill. It's a transmission of power. It, it's kind of like the transmission but it's a little different. A clutch is just it's kind of like a separating device. It separates the spinning from here and the spinning and gear ratios over here. And when you let go, it goes together and oh, they spin together. <laughs> All right. <laughs> so much fun. Yeah. Woo.